The signs on the route say, No parking Saturday, December 17th, 5 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. for Christmas Parade. It's December 17th, 2022, and today's adventure, we're going to the Christmas Parade at 5.30. But before that, we're going to the party at the Civic Center. That is from 2 p.m. to 5 p.m. Games, snacks, Santa, and Mrs. Claus. Wow, look who I found. The Grinch on a motorbike. Wait till I tell everybody I finally got to see him. Oh wait, I can show them. We're starting to head to the Civic Center for the lineup and the party. I just do it to make everyone happy. I've been doing it since COVID hit. Now I can mark that off my bucket list. Some parade entries have arrived. Paul and I walked down with grandchildren Jules and Van. Hi, how are you? Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Yeah. Uh -huh. It starts at 5:30. What do we do here? Yeah. What What do okay. they do? What's inside is food, face painting, games, prizes, snacks, a whole bunch of stuff. As we enter the Civic Center, Jules and Van and Paul are excited to get to meet the Grinch. Did I mention that that made my day? I am very impressed with the cold weather that the Grinch rides in. This is what the Grinch gave them. It says place the toy Grinch heart in water for 24 hours and watch it grow. And I can't forget, at 5.25 p.m. tonight, they're having an ugly sweater run. Get in the spirit with the community event. Here you can get Grinch Punch, candy canes, hot chocolate. Van is trying to make up his mind which cookies he would like to try. Jules has his Grinch Punch. I see Mr. and Mrs. Claus. Candy canes on all the tables. And over there's the Grinch. Here is the gingerbread house where they take their ticket to get a toy. The events are brought to you by the City of Kingwood, Blueprint Communities Kingwood, Friends of Preston County Parks and Recreations, and PCPARC. And here sits Bister and Mrs. Claus. Christmas Parade tonight's at 5.30. Then after that, they're having the city tree lighting, and Santa and Mrs. Claus will be handing gifts out. This is all at the McGrew house. They were doing face painting. Everything today at the events are free. Julian, our grandson, who was born on Christmas, <laughs> said that's pretty magical that everything's free. Gingerbread cake, and they'll go around the circle and they play music, and when it stops, they want to practice. They were having fun with their balloon swords. <laughs> and here's a photo spot. I regret that I never tried the Grinch Punch, but that looks pretty cool. The food looked amazing. The smiling faces were there to help get anything you wanted. Cookies, brownies, muffins, pepperoni rolls, and more. Served with red napkins and festive plates. Ugly Festival Royalty getting photos taken. How are you? Uh, I <laughs> One of the two tickets they were given gives them this game to play, where they open up one of the unopened cups and there's prizes inside. They also received a certificate to the new splash pad. Now to use their other ticket they received, they get to pick one of the gifts, one each. Jules made his mind up pretty fast. A big decision with so many choices. Now they're going to play the gingerbread game. They walk around and around until the music stops, and whoever stops on the one with the W gets the prize. Looks like a fun game. And the winners are off to get their prize. And they're off again with another round. And here's the mayor of Kingwood. It was fun. They had activities and they gave out some free cookies and, and hot cocoa. It was a lot of fun. I got 
a cookie, he a brownie, and Grinch Punch. We went outside to check out some of the floats that were there on the trailer that Santa will be riding. The Grinch's motorcycle. We found a group of antique farm tractors outside. I like the lights and decorations on them. Are you going to ride this tractor? I found out that some of these tractors and people are from Aurora. How's he get that front wheel? That front wheel like that. Back back here, get the rear wheels down, cut it real short, throw the front end over, right over right down the ramp. Right down the ramp. Okay. I didn't know it cut that quick. Yeah. I figure that's what he's going to do. Probably figure he's dropping down the ramp. No, no. Get loaded the same way. You gotta get your angle right and go in there, cut it over, put your front end up the ramp, cut it real quick, back the other way real quick, you can load. These are very nice and very impressive. The sign they're stapling underneath the Christmas tree says in loving memory of Darwin Welch, 1927 to 2022. You're getting Santa and Mrs. Claus's ride ready. This John Deere tractor is going to pull it. Another float has arrived. Decorations are being assembled. Parade route is a little different this year. It starts at the Civic Center, going on Tunnelton Street. Take a right on High Street, a left on Price Street, and ending at the McGrew property. And this is the Ugly Sweater Run. It started at 5.25 p.m. It's pretty cool this evening. The streets for the run and the parade have been blocked off. Some of the sweaters were pretty neat. Parade starts right after the run. Run, 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 run. You can do it.
followed one of the Grinches through downtown. We had a very fun walk. We got to watch the farm tractors go back through town again. And we picked up candy along the way. You can't believe how much candy was all over the street. It was a blast. We came down one side of the street, and when we returned, we went down the other side so we could see if we could find more. When we arrived, the kids were worried about the long lines. They were very organized. Santa's bride was glowing. We made it up to Santa and Mrs. Claus before you knew it. Santa, Mrs. Claus, I see an elf and some helpers. Thanks to everybody that was involved to help make this day wonderful for so many people. And just like that, everything was over. Thanks to the group that had the farm tractors and the trailer. We stopped by the tree to get a couple photos of Paul, Julian, Lillian, Randy, and Van. There goes the farm tractors. Safe travels home. Love your decorations. And this concludes this video. What a magical, wonderful day we've had today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, tap the bell to get notified, like, and share.